Bird. What about...
There's no need to think about this so much. You won't actually be dismantling the bomb. That's not for amateurs. What we'll try here instead is a temporary freezing measure. Here, look at this. This is a C-4 bomb. It's live. You can see it pulsing. Now you spray this on the sucker and... There we go. Simple, huh? The spray freezes the detonator instantly. How long does the effect last? There's no way the thing can detonate in this condition. Even if you leave it alone, it'll stay out of commission for at least 24 hours. That's enough time. If we had the manpower, I'd recommend complete disposal. But this will have to do. The spray can be used from several yards away. Now check the floor, ceiling, walls, under a table, everywhere. Try to imagine the locations the bomber would choose. That won't be easy. We don't know a thing about Fat Man. Is there anything that'll help us locate the bombs? Here, take this with you. It's what they call an ion mobility spectrometer. It can recognize ionized gas emitted by C4s. The what? In other words, that little gadget sniffs out C4's scent. That's right. I've established a link-up with your radar network, so any scent detected will be represented visually. Have the sensor activated and keep your eye on the radar. What if he's using some other odorless substance? Let's see how well that sensor works. All right. I'm activating them. Watch. You see the green stuff on the radar? That's a visual representation of the C4 scent detected by the sensor. It's a pretty big area, isn't it? Don't complain. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Just activate the sensors and search the area, okay? All right. Don't forget that you need the radar to use this system. Log into the node at every strut and turn the radar on. We have to keep out of the enemy's sight, too. Because the radar gets knocked offline when we're spotted? Exactly. Fat Man would have allotted some C4s here in Strut C as well. Here? Freeze! Don't kill me! 